Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all. Hey, wild child. Um, I just got out of Planet Fitness. The first video's dark, so I know you probably already know that if you saw it, so. Because I was leaving out at 4 something a.m. And it is now 6.12 a.m. And I am leaving the gym, Planet Fitness. And getting ready to go home and start the other part of my day. Have my smoothie, water, coffee. Thank you. You gonna keep on? You not? You just going slow, people? Yeah. So I am um, feeling amazing. My legs are sore today. This is uh, day number three. And I feel amazing. My legs are sore, but I feel good. Yeah, some guy walking. I don't know what he's doing. He stole a fan or something, child. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, I feel really good, y'all. Sore, but good. So, it's going to give me a pop of energy for the rest of my day. So, I'm, I'm excited. Just totally excited. I don't know why this car is up in my way, but we're going to keep on pushing. I don't know what they're doing. Ah, bump. Speed bump. Let's flip the camera for a minute. Y'all know what I look like. Lisa Michelle, be on the scale. I'm feeling somewhat good feeling good I'm just sore y'all super super sore so this is the back way I went behind um, went behind Walmart and everything just want you to see the um, pretty scenery and everything live in the Antelope Valley and there's um, all kind of um, what do you call them Joshua trees huh? Joshua tree is ugly to me, but they are very important. You have to look it up. Important for the um, ecosystem of the Antelope Valley, the AV. So there's plenty of them. They just grow wild and free. And guess what? I learned too when I looked it up. They're protected. They're actually protected trees. So let you see that beautiful sun shining over the um, Joshua trees. my blood sugar and everything put the camera back on top yeah I had um, took my blood sugar blood pressure and I take my medication and I take my shower get dressed feed the cat sometimes not in that order um, oh child this hair I don't work it out today um, and after all of that I usually start eating, you know, have my morning shake and coffee and rituals and things, but I'm building a new habit. It takes about a good two weeks to build a new habit, so 
so that's what I'm doing. And I haven't had anything to eat yet. I wanted to work out without anything in my stomach, which is perfect. I even have a um, peppermint. Thought I had a peppermint in my pocket. Oh, I'm feeling for it while I'm driving. Child, somebody that got my peppermint that made off with my peppermint. But anyway, I had a peppermint just in case I had a moment, which I didn't have a moment. The moment I'm having is the moment I'm having with you and myself, child. My hair, y'all. Looking like a wild woman. Yeah, so I just wanted to uh, check in with you all and let you know that, hey. I'm feeling good from my head to my shoes. Know where I'm going and I know what to do. Ooh, 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 ooh. I got a new attitude. I'm feeling good from my head to my shoes. Know where I'm going and I know what to do. Crazy people try to clip me. Ooh, 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 ooh. I got a new attitude. Yeah, I'm in this lane and they just not even looking, probably on the phone, and turning out into my lane. I said, no, this is what they make horns for. Pay attention, wake up, do something. Because guess what? I may be on this video. I got it on my phone holder. I'm not, hands, hands are free to drive. My eyes are on the road. You can see my face. I can make a video and drive, but... Shoot, I'm going to take my eyes off this road. Now here comes the doggone train. So we're going to embrace the moment. And I'm going to turn this camera so you can see what's cracking at the light. Okay, the train's coming from the, um, from the left side over that away. So the Metrolink is very close by my home. Let's see. Good old Metro Lane. I rode that many a times. It's a godsend. Especially when you're trying to get to the other side of town. Child, bye. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What you all doing today? Anything particular? I'm going to be going off uh, to uh, knitting this morning with Denise. Knitters going to knit at uh, Legacy Commons for active seniors. And I'm sit in there for a bit and do some knitting and relax. Chit chat with the other ladies that like to knit as I do. And then I'm going to go home and finish my art for an art club. Black card and almost clipped me riding off raggedy, pissed off. Oh well, you're gonna get over it, boo boo. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm gonna go be doing my my knitting and everything with the ladies and have my leg crossed and be enjoying myself. So, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go make coffee for uh, Chi Chi and I. So, yeah, I'm going to do that and then get ready to go to. Senior Center. Yeah. Thank you for riding home with me. It's nice to have a little nip of company, y'all. Ooh, the sun. The sun. Sunshine on my face. Oh, 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 oh. I'm nowhere feeling low. Don't take Personal, this life's a miracle, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Wake up this new day. Oh, oh, oh. 
have a good day. Stay positive and speak positivity over your life. I know it's sometimes hard and we say bad things to ourselves daily. But think about it because I heard this uh, analogy from someone. Would you talk bad like that about your very best friend? No, you treat them at least as far as I know. You treat your very best friend with the utmost respect. So treat yourself with that same respect and just be good to yourself and say positive things over your over your mind, body, and soul, spirit, everything. So keep good energy around you and good energy exudes just like bad energy exudes. So you have a wonderful, wonderful day and I will see you all on the flip side. Peace.